What would you do if, while standing in the middle of a busy airport, thousands of people just vanished? Are you ready for eternity? This question has plagued mankind from the beginning of time. Left behind a novel of Earth's last days is the, is the author's interpretation of the rapture and tribulation. Left behind is one of the most well-known Christian fiction books to ever be written. This book, which was released in 1996, has led to one of the largest selling book series in the world. This book, however, is not based totally on fiction, but rather an interpretation of biblical prophecies and about the end of the world. A book such as this brings a wide array of emotions, as it did when I read it. Before I relate to you the story, I will tell you about the authors Tim LaHaye and Jerry Jenkins. Tim LaHaye is a well-known speaker, minister, counselor, and a best-selling author. He has pastored a large church in San Diego. He founded several Christian high schools and helped found the Creation Research Institute. Jerry Jenkins is a former vice president of publishing at Moody Bible Institute of Chicago. Mr. Jenkins is an author of more than 175 books. Mr. Jenkins is also a best-selling author. Dr. LaHaye had the idea originally of writing a fictional account of the Christian rapture and the tribulation, and through a mutual friend, Dr. LaHaye and Jerry Jenkins teamed up to write the Left Behind series. Left Behind is the story of the rapture of the church and the beginning of the tribulation. The main characters of the story are Cameron Buck Williams, Captain Rayford Steele, Chloe Steele, Bruce Barnes, and Nikolai Carpathia. These characters find themselves lost in a dying world when one day God raptures and or removes his church. Imagine that one minute you are riding on a Boeing 747 when all of a sudden people vanish into thin air. This is the challenge faced by Captain Steele and Buck. They are lost and confused and are trying to find some answers. Ray returns home to find his wife and 12-year-old son missing. Only his daughter Chloe remains. Buck, who is a star reporter, is now seeking answers to these disappearances that will lead him to the truth of what has really happened. In the midst of all the chaos of millions of people disappearing off the face of the earth, from world leaders to the everyday general public, the biggest scare of all this is that every child on the face of the planet has disappeared. It is during this chaos that a leader steps forward, seemingly out of nowhere, to lead the fallen world. Nikolai Carpathia is now well on his way to control of the entire world. In the quest for truth, Ray and Chloe come into contact with the only man that seems to have any answers, Bruce Barnes. Bruce was an assistant pastor at the church where Ray's wife Irene and son Ramey attended. Bruce too is left behind, but with the realization that everything he had believed in was now destroyed. Bruce had believed that he was good enough to go to heaven, but what he missed as a pastor was that he could never be good enough. God is perfect, and he is the one who saves. Bruce finds the truth and surrenders his life to Jesus. It is after this that Bruce shows Ray and Chloe a video the senior pastor made concerning their present situation, which was made several years ago. Perplexed as they watch the video, Ray and Chloe are presented with the fact that they too are sinners and have a one-way ticket to hell. Only Jesus offers them the free gift of life through his saving grace. Buck, hot on the trail of the story of eternity, when he is confronted with the truth that he has missed as well. Just in the nick of time, before the Antichrist, Nikolai Carpathia takes over the whole world. Buck is able to see through the lies only by the new life that he is given by faith in Jesus Christ. The story of Left Behind jumps out at anyone living their everyday life with the realization that there really is a God and that you can have a personal relationship through him, with Him through His Son, Jesus Christ. The story that will smash the preconceived ideas that science and human opinion are the absolute authority on life. The book instead receives its instructions straight from the Bible. Unless God saves you through the redemption of His Son, you will be judged for what you have done. With guilt comes only one destination, and hell is not somewhere you want to be. Left Behind is a book that I would recommend to anybody. I feel that with the story that's conveyed 
the authors did a wonderful job in portraying that in a accurate manner. The use of scripture truly helps see how things could possibly go when the end times do come, and I would just truly recommend it. I'd be hard-pressed to say anything bad about the novel. The novel, once again, is Left Behind, a novel of Earth's The Last Days, written by Dr. Tim LaHaye and Jerry Jenkins, and can be purchased at Amazon.com. Thank you. Have a good night.